this one. I think this is cute. You know, yeah, you can't fit much in here besides maybe your keys and a license, but hopefully that's all you need on date night. Hopefully you're not paying. I like me better when I was yours. I'm going back, I'm going back, I'm going back, I'm going, I'm going back, I'm going, I'm going back to who I was before. I like me better, I like me better. Hey guys and welcome, welcome back to my channel. As you can see, we're a different setup today because today we are doing a try on of different Valentine's Day outfit ideas. You know, maybe you're getting creative this year. You're gonna have some type of date inside the house, right? Inside the house, backyard, whatever you're trying to do, but you still wanna look cute, right? So I, we, we are going to go into our closet and see what we can come up with outfit ideas. Maybe I'll give you inspo and maybe in the comments down below, you'll give me inspo. But if you're new here, then you might not know that Valentine's Day is also my birthday, okay? So I also have an outfit here that you could still wear. Like you can still, you know, uh, find inspo around this outfit and wear it for Valentine's Day. But just know this is what's going to be my 27th birthday outfit in my head and for social media because I don't have anywhere to go because all of my friends either live in different states or in the city. So um, if you guys want to see what I came up with, then let's go. So the first thing I've got here is this pink dress. You might remember this from the misguided try on haul that I did, but I saw it on the site. Like I was screaming Valentine's Day to me. Then when I tried it in that try on haul, I was like, absolutely, this is something I would wear for a date night. So this is the first thing that I've got for this first outfit. It's one sleeve. So the tag is still on this. That again, I don't have anywhere to wear this close to right now. Um, but it's one sleeve. This goes around the neck. And then this is like a, you know, uh, ruched siding on this dress. And then the shoes that I have to go with this. All right, so let me show them to you first. So this is the shoe that I picked to go with that dress. And here's the thing, when this type of, you see the heel? When that type of heel first started coming out, I was like, I don't know if that's a style that I like, but let me tell y'all, this might be the most comfortable type of heel to walk in, probably because, you know, the, the, the bottom of the heel is flat. So you've got a little bit more balance with this. When I tell y'all, this is an everyday heel. Like if you need a heel that you are going to wear out, okay? Cause you have to wear it here, you have to wear it there, you have to wear it. This is the one for you, okay? And with the color of this, it's gonna go with a whole bunch of stuff. So it's comfortable, it's cute. I'm still working on, you know, learning to love the heel. But like for the most part, listen, even if it's not for Valentine's Day, get you this shoe, okay? Cause She's the one. Okay, so see, this is why you plan things out in advance, right? Because I actually changed my mind and switched shoes with the other, one of the other outfits. I decided to wear this heel with this dress instead. And I forgot to show you guys the little mini bag to go with this one. I think this is cute. You know, yeah, you can't fit much in here besides maybe your keys and a license, but hopefully that's all you need on date night. Hopefully you're not paying, okay? Um, so this, you know, it's supposed to be like a little uh, imitation Jacquemus bag. So uh, who I? was not about to spend $500 on 600 on the real one. So get you a cute little mini bag, okay? Throw your gum in there, call it day with this dress. Now, if you guys remember when I tried this on, um, for this side, you know, there's no strap. So uh, you'll probably have to use like double-sided tape or something like that. But other than that, this dress is real nice, real comfortable, real flattering while it's on. Like I said, this is from Misguided. The little mini bag is from Forever 21. And then the shoes are from Simi London. You can see another pair, very comfortable to walk in. They've certainly gotten use out of this heel. So this is the first one. I'm trying to think, uh, no, no complaints with all. Oh, the only thing with these shoes is that, you know, because it's like uh, this here, that's that's the only thing that you got going for you, your foot starts to slide down after a couple hours. But you know, again, hopefully you'll just be sitting pretty. You won't have to walk lunch and you won't have to worry about that. So this is the second outfit. I believe this dress is from Pretty Little Thing. It's old, I'm pretty sure I bought this like a year ago or something like that. Actually, this, the tag should still be on this, but I'm pretty sure it's Pretty Little Thing. Um, but I like this dress. Again, you guys see a theme with the whole like ruching thing going on. It does have a like a drawstring right down the middle of the dress so you can pull it up to wear it shorter. You guys know those type of dresses, but this one, like I like the length that it's at. Um, and then I like that it's not like, uh, like it doesn't fully go over your shoulder, it kind of cuts off 
where it does and then you know just throw on a cute little black bag this is the only one like that was size appropriate for this outfit not so well actually looking at it i'm gonna say not so sure like this specific one i would do with this dress but actually looking at it not that mad and then of course the shoes are the first pair that i showed you the did i even say where those were from the ones from ego with a little blockish heel those i would wear with this outfit but again you know dinner if you're going to dinner or dinner's being made for you at the house very cute uh dress for that occasion and very comfortable as well like i said those shoes you can go anywhere <laughs> you can go anywhere with this with those shoes so this one actually i, I know i want somewhere to wear this one too like I, know, I want a place to wear the other ones too but this one like now i really want a place to wear this one too and i feel like this one makes me feel taller granted don't know i'm short but some outfits they just make you feel like yes i'm actually this height and i'm not standing on my tippy toes like this so this next one i need y'all to just follow along with the vision right so this is for the more dressed down casual day but see i'm a firm believer in like there's gotta be something in your outfit that makes the outfit pop right so i've got a real simple outfit right here a uh, basic white top well, is a bodysuit and then blue jeans under it right so you want to know what's good actually two things that'll make this pop but this is this is the real thing that's gonna make this outfit pop you want to see what it is i can't wait okay y'all these are the shoes that i picked to go with that outfit i don't care what anyone says i love these boots okay i was on again akira's website these are by azila wang i believe is who the actual designer of these are but it's it's sold on akira's website i am here for these boots i don't care what anyone says yeah i said a little bit more casual day but i'm talking about the people who still wear heels on casual dates okay if you don't replace these boots with red sneakers or anything like that but i'm just saying you know um if i wanted to wear jeans on it something like that i'm putting these boots on just because these boots are gonna make the outfit pop and i also have a red bag to go with so let me go ahead and put this outfit on so you see what i'm saying about the boots how the boots are what make this outfit like you just you look at it and they're the first thing that you notice right so love the boots like i said said where this is from the top is from boohoo the pants if they're not from pretty little thing then they're from fashion nova i really don't know they're old hopefully it's on the tag when i'm filling out the description and then i didn't even know ego sold accessories like that but i got this bag from ego and it was i think it was on sale or it was horrible or something like that um but of course that'll all be linked down below and then this uh necklace is also from akira so that will be down below and like i said you know like for the casual i don't know like maybe if we weren't on lockdown you were going to a basketball game because football's gonna be over by the time um we get to valentine's day you were going to a basketball game you could wear this outfit you know like a little more casual but you know you still bougie so gotta do a little something to be extra there right so that's what i would wear this one for and now the last one the one i'm most excited about because like i said if i was going anywhere for my birthday it's what i would be wearing but best believe i'm gonna wear this outfit somewhere at some point okay y'all gonna see me in this outside of social media um it's this right here first the top you guys remember from a vlog that i posted not too long ago um it's from jaded london you'll see you'll see how it's actually supposed to fit on once i put it on and then i have this skirt that is from pretty little thing and then and then these are the shoes that i got for that outfit you see how i'm playing with like color blocking for this outfit and of course of course my birthday outfit had to be colorful right it's me um so and it also has the you know Heel, more square uh heel at the bottom so again gonna be comfortable on let me put it on listen these colors are doing what i needed to be done okay all the way here for it love how all the colors just pop on me um now with the top uh of course i don't have a bra on right now you don't need you can literally the the way you can tie this you can tie it yourself in the back you can literally just tie this and have support um you don't want to wear a bra or anything like that i do have boob tape on i gotta take pictures after this video um i do have boob tape on the the same boob tape i did the whole video on so just you know throwing that out there if you're like i'm just supposed to do that if i can't wear a bra or if i don't want to wear a bra um so that's what i have on and like you can be fine you know you move it around and you'll be fine throughout the day throughout the night wherever you're wearing this too but yeah like i said so i'm gonna go see this out because it's just it's a bummer this is where we are this, this is my first uh quarantine birthday last year everything started like pretty much the month after so i was still able to go out for my birthday but it's okay it's okay you know um 
I've got this up, right? I'm giving you guys an idea. I'm being helpful to the internet. Okay, so um, hopefully any of the outfits that I tried on in this video gave you some ideas. Let me know if you are doing anything. Well, let me know what you're doing first. Um, and then let me know what you plan to wear. Or, you know, will you just be launching it in the house? Let me know all of that down below. All the information for everything that I showed in this video will be down below. Uh, and yeah, make sure two thumbs up, comment. I'm tired of sitting on my tippy toes, y'all. I'm short, okay? Um, make sure two thumbs up, comment, subscribe, your notification bells, all of that down below. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Thank you.